Almadraba in Spanish Portuguese, Almadrava, is a word of Al-Andalus Arabic origin Almdurft Almadrava, a place to strike, to strike, hit. It is an elaborate and age-old Phoenician technique for trapping and catching Atlantic bluefin tuna that was learned and taken to areas such as Iberia during Iberia's Islamic period. The technique is to trap and catch the tuna when they are crossing between the Atlantic Ocean to the Mediterranean during February to July, on their way to spawn and until recently, on its return journey, al Rives, when they come back into the Atlantic Ocean, they also bycatch, bullet tuna, oxus rache, little tunny, euthanus aleteratus, Atlantic bonito, sarda sarda, big Tuna Thunus obesus, and swordfish Xiphius gladius. It is a traditional form of tuna fishing or netting fence to catch tuna that is carried out in Italy, Morocco, Portugal, mainly in the Algarve, and Spain, mainly Andalusia, Murcia, and Valencia. A similar technique exists in Sicily known as matanza, a borrowing from the Spanish word matanza, meaning slaughter, introduced either by the Moors during Sicily's own Islamic period or by the Spanish afterwards. In film Roberto Rossellini's Stromboli includes documentary shots of the Matanza. Rupert Murray's The End of the Line 2009 film demonstrates Almadrava when discussing declining catches. Portuguese short documentary film P.T.A. Almadrava Atunera, directed by Antonio Campos. See also Barbate, town known for its Almadrava fishing. Favignana, a Sicilian island where Matanza is performed. The Dukes of Medina Sidonia made their fortune on the monopoly of Andalusian almadravas from the 12th to the 19th century. Zahara de los Atunes, an Andalusian town named after the tunas of its almadrava. Castle of Zahara de los Atunes and Palace of Jadraza References <laughs>